Hi everybody, so hopefully I don't mumble and jumble and like don't make any sense. Um, I'm just gonna talk from my mind right now, from the dome. I have like no list of like the things that I want to talk about, so I'm just gonna speak. Especially since today is September 24th, I believe, and it's Monday and I filmed a video speaking about like the whole situation of about the last video and I told Desmond that once he gets home I want to speak about the whole situation with you guys with him a shout out to everybody on Instagram who um, asks questions we're gonna try to read all of them and answer any questions that you guys have by the way if I sound congested one I always kind of sound congested, but right now I feel like I sound extra congested because I, I just have a stuffy nose. Like, it's super muggy out, and whenever it's, like, muggy and raining and ugly out, like, my nose just gets, like, very, very stuffy. Um, and some of you guys have asked about that, by the way. I just have allergies, y'all. Like, sometimes I can't breathe through my nose, and for the most part, some I, I, I can't, like, breathe through my nose because my nose is stuffy but um i've gotten so used to breathing through my mouth that like even when i'm not stuffy i breathe through my mouth so that's why some of you guys are like oh why do you sound stuffy well, that's the reason i've gone to the doctor they said i'm fine i just have like crazy allergies anyways <sighs> what to talk about so as you guys can see i have like i look kind of bummy uh, my hair is up i just finished working out uh, I feel amazing as you guys saw or maybe you didn't see a few videos back. I um, Showed you guys my 21 day fix uh, This is raw and unedited by the way uh, Excuse me. I showed you guys my 21 day fix and I told you guys I was gonna start that and so today I got an amazing Email by the way, I have a bunch of emails from you guys. So shout out to you guys and DMS I haven't gotten to everybody. There's so many and so many comments I literally did not get to anybody in the last video. There was like a thousand comments, literally. And it's going to be super hard to comment back to everybody, the emails, the DMs, the comments. So my bad if I don't comment back and my bad if I comment back late. Anyways, I read this email from a lady named Sharon. So shout out to you. Her email was just super amazing. And she literally like motivated me to work out today long story short her email was basically about like she asked like if if i wasn't truly happy with myself would i feel hold up let me make sure i'm saying it right she was saying that since i don't take time for myself and since i haven't like mentally um gotten healthy and physically gotten healthy that might be one of the reasons why I'm like extra sensitive and I feel like even if I was super healthy even if I lost all the weight that I wanted to lose like certain things that Desmond said in that video it would have still hurt me but I feel like lately I've been extra 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 sensitive because I'm not 100% happy with myself and I question myself a lot you guys like I've been noticing that lately that like even with my friend Ron like I just feel like when she talks to me and she says that I'm like a strong person and she doesn't know how she would react to the things that I've gone through the this past year and then I'm always questioning myself like am I strong like other people would go about this in a better way like I feel like I'm just extra emotional I feel like sometimes I feel like I'm weak and um that's some personal shit and I've been making everything that I've gone through an excuse to why I'm not happy but one of the reasons why is because I don't even try to look for happiness within myself and I make excuses as to why I eat unhealthy and I've been eating so unhealthy I've been, I'm like the heaviest that I've ever been um, sometimes I do let like certain comments get to me as far as my weight because that's a personal issue that I have within myself and at the end of the day I'm only human you know like I won't let um the negative comments like ruin my day but as far as like if I see like a comment about my weight or something I'm like ooh, 
that's kind of true, you know, like the truth hurts sometimes. But, um, yeah. Um, but besides that, like literally my, within myself, like I just haven't been doing things for myself, like getting my nails done, losing weight, going to the gym or even working out in the house. Um, and today after I saw that email from Sharon, once again, shout out to you. I just got this burst of energy and honestly I was not gonna work out today like I have my CDs and I already had it in my mind like oh, you're tired you're tired you're not gonna work out today and then when I read that email like and it's crazy because out of all the emails I clicked on that one and because her name stood out to me because she's always emailing us and I really needed that and so I worked out I did some Zumba a lot of you guys ask like if I watch someone while I'm dancing, because you guys follow me on Instagram and you see that I, I dance to like hip hop music or whatever, you see it on here that I dance to hip hop music and I literally make that stuff up while the song is playing. Like you guys don't see the behind the scenes, like where, when I stop and I try to think of like the next move. Um, and a lot of you guys have been asking me to like make youtube videos just dancing and i wish i could but i would get copywritten if i use the music that i love using while i dance um but yeah i literally come up with the with the moves by myself i have worked out enough i mean not lately oh my gosh my nose is like literally about to start dripping came through dripping drip drip came through dripping okay let me let me try to hide that by the way this is unedited um i literally come up with those moves by myself so just wanted to let you guys know that and then just now i was on instagram and i was about to post like a little clip of the dance that i did today because i recorded myself baby girls back there sleeping by the way i recorded myself and i was like i need to create an instagram and i need to really make that my priority to post on there uh, and i did this maybe like three years back when i was trying to lose weight and then i just like stopped posting just like my mukbang channel i stopped posting but mainly on my mukbang channel i stopped posting because i was eating like unhealthy stuff and i just like I was I just been super busy with YouTube with like our YouTube channel the family YouTube channel but um as far as the Instagram I had one and then I just stopped posting and then I started to gain weight but I created a new Instagram and it's called Kiara's Kiara is losing it something like that um I'll have the name to the Instagram down below and I just posted my first video and I'm going to try my best to post there every single day so that I can keep myself accountable. And then you guys can keep me accountable if you would like to help me because seriously, like my weight has been a struggle, like, and my health has been a struggle ever since, um, I became an adult, literally in my whole adult life. Like, well, I'd say after I gave birth to Jericho, actually, like, I was always overweight, but I looked okay, you know, for my weight. Um, for my height, I'm 5'3 and a half. I'm supposed to be like 155 pounds, but um, I've always been like 180 and I look fine at that weight, you know, like when I'm 150, well, I haven't been 155 in a while, but if I was to be 155 or if I were to be 155, I would just probably look sick because I was at 173 years ago and that was like the best I've ever felt and the best I've looked like my body looked fine at that weight if I would have been any smaller I probably would have looked really sick but yeah so go follow my Instagram I'm gonna try to post every day probably try to post like my workouts the things that I eat um, and all that like, good stuff today I'm gonna try to go to some stores to get some like healthy food and actually eat it because literally you guys I'll buy like lettuce and like spinach and it'll stay in my fridge like I'll use it once or twice and then it'll rot so that's just how it's been for the past few weeks ever since or the past few months since I've gave, given birth to Kalia um, 
yeah, since I gave a birth to Kalia, I have gained so much weight. Like the first week of uh, me being postpartum or whatever, um, I lost all of my baby weight. I was 121 and I went down to, uh, sorry, 121. I was 221 and I went down to 203, which is like less than what I weighed when I found out what I was pregnant because I was 210 when I found out. And now you guys, like I said, I've been my, this is the heaviest, heaviest I've ever been. I'm even heavier than I was when I gave birth. I am 222. And that's super embarrassing to say, but I literally need to find happy, happiness within myself. Like, I need to say 222 and love myself enough to fix that, you know, since I don't like that number. Fix that. And then not give a crap about what anybody says about me being that weight, you know? I just need to improve myself mentally and physically and just make myself happy. If I want to look good in a certain dress or in certain heels or just look good, period, I need to fix it. I need to eat better. And it's easier said than done, you know? I mean, for those of you who start, struggled with weight, you guys know it's easier said than done. But it's, it's just that easy, just like with me and Desmond's, like, argument. If I don't like certain things about him, it's just that easy for him to fix it and to not be, you know, so not emotional. Or as far as me, like, you know, any th- issues that I have that he doesn't like, it's it's, like, really easy. It should be really easy just to change it, you know? I feel like just we're humans and it's just, like I said, easier said than done because we're so stubborn and we just want to do what we want to do. Like, as far as losing weight, I want to eat a motherfucking cheeseburger, so I'm going to eat a cheeseburger, you know? Am I making sense? You guys probably think I'm, like, talking all over the place, but I hope you guys understand what I'm saying. (sighs) But I really do need to eat healthier. I'm going to try to, you know what? I'm not going to try to. I'm going to stop eating anything that has to do with sugar. I need to figure out a way to drink my coffee and actually like it because I like coffee. Uh, I just need like a boost of energy in the morning. And since I'm breastfeeding, I can't really take pre-workouts because you can't take that while you're breastfeeding. I need to find either a pre-workout that I can take while I'm breastfeeding or drink some good coffee that doesn't have a bunch of sugar or just fall asleep earlier and go to sleep fall asleep earlier and wake up early and that'll help me you know have some energy and then just work out once I drop off the kids (sighs) we'll figure it out you guys we will figure it out anyways um this was just a quick update on just me not really obviously about like the situation that happened in the last video um i will be coming with an update soon oh excuse me um i don't know if i mentioned this but i did update you guys earlier i did like three videos because i i kept like missing things i kept um forgetting to say certain things oh my god this is so unedited goodness gracious i have boogers um and so I recorded that, but then I thought to myself, I need to make this video with Desmond. So hopefully tonight we can do that video. I have my camera charging at home. And sorry if I, like, my nose just sounds so crazy, but you you guys can understand what I'm saying while I'm talking. So, (sighs) yeah, once again, go follow the Instagram. Go follow my Instagram. It's Kiara, K-I-A-R-A, period, Cassell, C-A-S-S-E-L-L. And then my Instagram that I just created, I literally just created it. So it's K-I-A-R-A-I-S-L-O-S-I-N-G-I-T. Kiara is losing it, I think. Or Kiara is losing it. Once again, I'll have it in the description down below. (sighs) I love you guys. And I appreciate all of the comments. Once again, um, I am in high spirits, as you guys can tell. I'm feeling just more positive and motivated today and I feel happy and I am in the on the search or on the I don't even know how to say it I am going to find myself again and I'm going to 
make myself happy again, you know? Because my kids make me happy, like, on the daily. Like, just, like, little things, like their smile, their laugh, just their little faces make me happy. But I, myself, need to make Kiara happy. Like, myself. You need to make yourself happy, girl. Anyways, I love you guys, and you guys will see us tomorrow. Peace out. Oh my gosh, come on. Peace out.